because they're off in the Woodbine Million. Firm dancer broke well. Victory speaks to the inside. Skip away is taken in hand early, and Stephanotis wants the front and quickly crosses over to the rail as they move in front of us for the first time, and Stephanotis has the lead. Victory speech is second. Victor Cooley is on the outside third. Pat Day has the Preakness winner, Lily Couture's settling in on the rim. Fourth position and in behind that one is a skip away. Then we have O'Dowd and a firm dancer. And it's Stefan Otis who's loose on the lead with about six furlongs to run. Victory speech attracts in second. Louis Couture's is a close third, just two lengths off the lead. Victor Cooley's back in fourth now. Shane Sellers has a skip away in fifth, five lengths off the lead. Then Firm Dancer and O'Dial. Less than five furlongs to run. That initial half was in 46 and four. Stefan Otis leads it by a length. On the outside, Victory Speech is second. They will need some running room with Louis Couture's. Victor Cooley has him pinned down on the rail. Skip away, three and a half lengths off the lead, then Firm Dancer and O'Dial. Three furlongs to run in the Woodbine Million. They got three quarters and ten and three. On the inside, Stefan Otis, and now Stevens is calling for Victory Speech to put in his run. As they come to the quarter pole, Victory Speech on the outside and Stefan Otis on the inside. Sellers has Skip away, knocking at the door as they come to the top of the stretch. Stefan Otis, Victory Speech, and here comes Skip away. Skip away up on the outside as they come to the final furlong. And Skip away has this field on the ropes. On the inside, Stefan Otis second. Victor Cooley is closing on the outside. But Skip away takes center stage. He wins the Woodbine Million. It's tight for place between Victor Cooley and Stefan Otis.